Civil Engineer. I'm here in the IC headquarters, number one Great George Street, outside library where we have the Superheroes exhibition. I'm here to talk to you about the Singma Bridge in Hong Kong. Now Hong Kong, in my opinion, is one of the greatest cities in the world. Otherwise known as a fragrant harbour, where east meets west, it has the most number of skyscrapers in the world and is one of the most densely populated. I remember walking through Hong Kong on a cloudy April day, wondering why I was drenching in sweat. I think this body is not used to 96% humidity. Hong Kong's Chetlap Kok Airport was built on a small island just off Lantau Island. It was part of the Airport Core Programme, which required land reclamation, new motorways and a new link between the island and the mainland. The result, Sing Ma Bridge which is named after the two islands on each end of the bridge. Sing Ma Bridge is a beautiful suspension bridge over the Ma Wan Channel. Now a suspension bridge suspends the bridge deck through cables along a main cable which runs along the length of the bridge. And this distributes the weight safely and evenly across the bridge. Sing Ma Bridge has a length of 1,377 metres. It is the 11th longest suspension bridge in the world. It is also the world's longest road and rail bridge and the longest double-deck bridge. The bridge is used by around 90,000 vehicles a day and it takes around 25 minutes to travel from the airport to downtown Kowloon. So the Singma Bridge is a great transport project and I'm a transport engineer. So since graduating university, um, I've been lucky enough to work on great civil engineering projects. So I've designed um, bus priority schemes in London and Bristol, I've been a venue transport manager for the London 2012 Olympics team. I've been a design manager improving transport for London's roads and I'm currently a technical manager working on a large regeneration scheme in West London. Civil engineers design and build infrastructure schemes that transform our daily lives. Have a think about the moment you wake up to when you get to work or school. There's a huge number of civil engineering projects that you probably pass that you don't even notice on a day-to-day -day basis but they transform your lives. Many people that don't know anything about civil engineering will probably call us boring. But have a look on the IC200 website. There's countless number of civil engineering projects that demonstrate that us civil engineers commit art and science to produce beautiful structures that are far from boring.